guys, welcome to week four in our fours and fives class in our uh, April series, Big News. This week we're gonna continue on in a couple fun activities and some things that we've been doing out, been doing throughout this whole month. Sorry, got a little tongue tied there. Um, so this week our Bible story is about Paul and Silas. Um, and then our focus is gonna be that I can tell others about Jesus even when it's hard. Um, so to kind of help introduce that for them, um, we've been doing this really cool breaking news activity. Some of you guys have been loving it. I know a lot of the kiddos that I've been seeing are really enjoying pretending to be newscasters and pretending to talk about the weather. And so um, our first week, if you remember, we did like, you know, we had the, um, the little video camera and the microphones and then just the basic weather like uh, pictures, the sunny day, the cloudy day, windy days. And then we've kind of been building from that. So last week we had um, people and the people were to represent that God's church is growing. So more people are coming to know God. Um, and then this week we have um, these kind of happy face, this happy face and this smiley face. And so that's going to help them tie in about the idea of we can tell people about God and Jesus when it's a good day and even when it's a hard day or a bad day. So um, that's something that they can do. There's um, verbiage in here, ways that you can help them kind of understand what's happening. Um, but let them have fun with that and play with that. We have tons of you know outfits that they can dress up in and things like that so um, that are already in the class so I think they're loving it and I think they'll continue to really love it so that's your first activity after that um, our twos and threes friends are gonna come join you for worship and Bible story um, just a little disclaimer our uh, expansion that's been taking place is uh, phase one is done and it looks awesome and so we are officially moving our fours and fives class into its almost permanent it's permanent new classroom. So uh, Lori and Chad will help you guys find that spot. It's gonna be um, a little hard to explain on camera, but you guys will, you guys will know it when you're here. Um, but it's pretty much gonna be the class that we're gonna be in from here on out. So it is beautiful. Uh, there'll be new toys, new things to play with, kind of get the lay of the room a little bit, figure out things that you don't want the kiddos to play with. There's gonna be a lot more options, so they're probably gonna go nuts. So uh, just kind of stay on that a little bit, but a lot more room. There's gonna be a bathroom in the room, which is so great. So. Um, just so you know, our twos and threes friends are gonna be coming down to a brand new room. Um, so we'll kind of just have to go with the flow there because it's gonna be really exciting for them and for us because it's beautiful. So once they do their Bible story and they learn all about Paul and Silas, they're gonna head back to their classroom. And then in your class, you're gonna do a fun activity um, to kind of reiterate that story. So it's called Knock It Down. It's when Paul and Silas are in jail. Um, and so the idea of hard days, being in jail is not the most fun. So, um, but that they, we're still able to tell people about Jesus even in that hard moment. So we have blocks in that room. There's wood blocks, there's also squishy blocks. Um, you'll see it when you get in there. Um, have them actually build a little bit of a, like their own version of a jail or even a wall, kind of stack up those blocks, and then they're gonna knock it down. And while they're doing that, it's a great option to tell them the story again, to hit the high notes of it, so it'll be a fun little activity for them. And then lastly, they're just gonna do their craft, which is called Jailbirds. Um, it's really simple, it's just a coloring page. Uh, you can have them do this at the beginning or end, doesn't matter to me, but it's this little piece of paper, each kiddo gets one, it has Paul and Silas and in jail, and then on the top it says, I can tell others about Jesus. Um, let them color it with some crayons, we'll have boxes of crayons for you in your little cart, um, and that's going to be their take home, it's really simple today. Uh, that's all I have for you guys. I will not be here this weekend. I'm going to be uh, out of town with family. Uh, so Saturday night, Chad and Lori are your go-tos. Uh, Sunday morning, uh, Monica Leininger will be there. She's awesome. Um, so if you need anything, let me know. And if you're not going to be able to serve, please text me as soon as you can so I can pass it along to um, Chad and Lori and Monica. And uh, we'll just have a great weekend. So thank you guys so much for serving. I will see you next weekend. Thanks.